I am joined by NFL Network's analytics expert, Cynthia Freeland. Cynthia, the Bengals have been in the AFC Championship game now in back-to-back -back seasons. With the way this team is built and structured, why have they been able to have that type of success now? Well, first off, you're really help, helped out by um, a guy named Joe. Uh, he's pretty good, and so is Jamar. So look, no, when you when you draft the right players and you get the right system that really accentuates their positives, you get great results, right? So that has been a really smart situation. I love the coaching staff. I'm like a Lou Anarumo stan. Like I will be number one, like banging the drum. You're so lucky that he's back because he makes like really great, like easy, simple structures for his defensive players. They'll be the first to tell you this is a team. This is a team that's complementing each other. Their strengths. Why will they be in the mix then again this season in the AFC? Look, the AFC is a nightmare. Being able to create the different types of threats. So deep threats, you've got great pass catchers, you've got a great running situation because I will put Samaji Piran right in that conversation with Joe Mixon. They're both awesome. The three threat, right? Keep the Joe, the T, and the Jamar. Keep that intact. Those are some of the best draft picks that this franchise has ever made. And then that defense being able to stop, like there were so many second halves where not one point was scored. And that is massive. A lot of that has to do with the right blend of people. Now, Cynthia, you're the queen of analytics. I always love when I see you plot these stats and numbers. I'm like, how did she find this? Where did she get this from? So I want to ask you, over the last season, is there a stat, a number, something that you found related to the Bengals that's kind of stuck with you, maybe a little bit more than others? People aren't being like, you know who the number one pass rusher is? They're not saying Trey Henderson, right? They're, they're not saying it. They're not talking about Sam Humber. They're not. But the duo together, that was super impressive. The fact that them together had the highest pressure rate of any team. That's so massively important because these are two guys who are like doing their job consistently and really well. And I also love the Jamar Chase stat because he had to adjust his routes. And I like Jamar Chase is so much fun to track when you track him with computer vision and we because this kid runs really fast in, from his first step and in the fourth quarter, it's the same fast and speed, like that first quick burst as the first quarter. Well, Cynthia, love your work, big fan of it. Thank you so much for spending time with us. Love it. I'm a big, like, people don't know this. I have, like, a Bengals shirt, and I wear it. I live in Southern California, and people come up to me on the strand, and like, who day? I'm like, yes, exactly, who day? And my, my dog wore his little 513 uh, bandana. We're big fans.